teams faced just a few weeks ago. It was quite tight. We should be expecting the same thing over towards the long area now. Tig waiting up for that first approach. It's going to be Jonah P with that first kill. Saya player doing the same thing. But this Nebula is just allowing so many trades, so many 50-50s. But it's the take from Garage that opens things up. Yeah, Moose not able to hold it down in that back line. Now these two players from LG have to retake from the defender. Spawn Trent already in holding this angle as a spike. Get it down, but that shock dart it actually oh. does deny. Stellar now, Trent. Has to not only pick up the spike, but has to go for the plant. But look how close already Mata and Dazzle are. Valen now has to play up on the 1v2 turret around the corner. And he can't even play up on the left side, but the turret actually accidentally detected something. To be nobody here, Seeker's going in. Nebula covering up both choke points here on B. So they should, in theory, be free for, for the guard. But the shock dart going in through the Nebula. Strikes down on Asaya and Dazzle's able to get another one. This is now just chaos for the guard. They had their space, they had their util, but now the Nebulas, they start to dissipate. But look at this from behind. Valen clearing Valen? the space, able to get a big one, and Trent is there for the trade. That actually equalizes the round, and now they have a red carpet back to C. Yeah, Trent's already gonna make this mad dash, and both of these LG players, Moose and B Dog, they might get caught off here by Net. Net is gonna try and cut them Net. off in this rotation. Needs to get both of us. It's a one and done. He will find the first and immediately backs away. He will regroup with Trent to try and play this 2v1. Yeah, technically a one and done, but it's because he just booted the hell out of there. So here we go, B Dog. Can't do anything about it. Net with 70 HP, but the SMG shoots just that. He wants this first pick. Saya player is actually in a 1v1 against them. It's off the off. Oh, ho, ho. There you go. They just make their full take. So there goes a Cosmic Divide in the back line, but the Hunter's Fury is there to try to help too. Comes in right on time. 15 seconds left. Still no ground has been made for the guard here on site, but that flash is so big. Tig, a gap in the smoke, but he can only get one. Now with a double, and this now leaves the guard with a four on two. The Cosmic Divide should yep. be going down in a few, and not only that, but I think that the Sova was actually heard. Mata all the way out in the open, and that's the round for the guard. Three players surrounding this B site. Let's see if it's actually a full commitment. Nanostorm pops, and the spike is actually going down. This one's just going nice. to be a whole fire fest. Oh, early swings coming out. Jonah P and Net able to find both Dazzle and Mata as they try and swing, swing into the side and try and hold them off. Yeah. And, I mean, the rotations were, were right on time, oh, too. No, it that's was, the op. That is so unfortunate. Like you said, Tully, that's the op. And can they get a phantom back? Oh! They right. They are going to be ready for it, I imagine. So, Valen is going to work this with his teammates. He'll take this point. Fight, but beat out. Okay, finding one. Yeah, Saya needs to find the second. Oh, there you no. go. No way they're going to expect Dazzle here. They might as well peek them. Net. Oh, net. As his classic out, Dazzle's gonna be able to nail him. Now has an op. Saya player peeking him on the right side. There goes up a smoke, but that can't find a pick there, especially if Moose oh, goes down, but that he doesn't. Worked. Moose will pick up the first. A three versus two down to just two here, and that recon bolts. Oh, and they ping. They know where Trent is. The shock darts just buying a couple of extra seconds as they're trying to isolate this fight. This is lovely. You still from the Viper! Oh, Valen! One map you could your company you can beat any team on, and he said Haven, and they're showing nice. It. Nice and aggressive here in this round. Oh, Asaya just scooping on through the gross. garage side, and you love it from there. Is going to be that turret spawning with Dazzle out with a peek early, but the hub trapped into the turret. It does essentially nothing for Dazzle. He's able to get absolutely nothing. Saya, no. oh, that's a little bit unfortunate to say the least. Waits for the pop off the smoke, and now the lockdown clearing out the rest of the site, but the spike still planted. This east side down and. Up 9-0, another exit frag, but that's really all she rolled. <gasps> oh no! Doesn't even escape. I would it's expect fast. from the double. guard's defensive side instead. Oh, but Saya! No! The double updraft! Exposing oh, B-Dog and exposing everyone in long. I mean, right when you thought that LG were trying to do something cheesy that could actually work, all three, all four players get revealed because of the updraft, and Nets able to get two. The guard now, they have full control of Seaside as they go around the world in a 5v4. Four players lined up out towards Long, one in towards Cubby. They're gonna try and stick in here. The Vipers. Oh, Poison Orb is up. They are getting some picks here and Moose. Oh, oh. Just barely enough time, oh. but it really was never gonna be enough. Valen to take the round for the guard. That's 11 to. I don't exactly know if he was spotted or if he saw any of these players back over in mid, but. Oh, oh no, man. LG, oh, LG! They thought about Garage for a quick second, but they walk right back into the two-man crossfire in the middle of B. Oh, Moose and Tig. Moose is probably gonna go down to the side. Yes, he will. Saya player looking for another one. Mega long range against Tig, who's all the way over in C long. Does end up getting the kill off of the Frenzy, but it's a 1v4 for this, and he can't do anything with it. 12 to We're pretty strong. 
And, uh, you know, I was like, I was, I was hyped on the guard. I was like, yeah, <laughs> right. val Valen Phenomenal IGL. Trent from the trenches has come up to tier one. Like, like the guard are looking good. And we were thinking the same thing for LG, but this is <laughs> a right. way out of proportion. The guard with one round left. We do have to watch out for what would be LG. Just this mid control period because they have effort with 20 seconds left. This is for the map here. They force bot for a reason. They have everything oh. that they could possibly need for this. So in we go. Moose gonna be able to get the first, and B Dog gets the second close range. Valen is here real quick though off that SMG and is able to get one, but not more than one. Now only two players remaining for LG. It's Tig and B Dog. B Dog. Oh no, no. B Dog is the last person remaining now in that one v two. Oh, big headshot off the Marshall. Needs a quick scope on the net to make it happen. But Valen going deep. At the exact same time, Moose. Oh, he's just getting assaulted. Zane main and it will be net to just pull his teleports back here b dog all oh, the one-way smoke almost working perfectly to find one one trade it looks like take wanted to get aggressive and he's granted a kill right for here. a 3v2 Ooh, the two could be made a little bit worse though there goes dazzle around the corner taking down saya player tig doing the exact box trying to take down each other the valen oh he's pretty much on top of the spike but it was just a fake but tig gets absolutely destroyed from the jump Valen was over an arcade. You do have one close though, Saya player playing up that crossfire against Trent, and in comes the rest of the players. These phantoms, they just grind out. No, excuse me, it's actually Spectres around the corner. Only SMGs here, but actually Moose. Two kills back of the classic. These last two players are oh, incredibly no, no, no. late, but how do they actually get that kill back into Valen? They can't heal. Oh right. no! B Dog coming in with a big kill into Jonah P out of nowhere, too. Nets now in a 1v2, but this one is quite possible. Yeah, very low HPM. Stick oh, to the really ghost. Low. Oh, Moose around the corner again. One, one shot to the body should be able to do it, but the flash in his face, and now he's only one hit, too. Nets. In the exact same paper thin position as his opponents. And LG guard having to face on a 5v5 retake. Orbital strike. Guard and yeah, aftershock to come in to keep these players back in canteen. Tig has even got a post plan lineup and Mata just playing up close is gonna throw out the blast back and try and hold them back for a second longer as he finds the one frag. B Dog trying to spray haphazardly. Oh Things are starting to come crumbling down here for the guard as both Saya and Jonah oh. P try to put on this pressure, but Saya in a oh. one versus two Saya. knows where the last player is but doesn't have the time, and that's LG taking a third round by the skin of their teeth. No apologies, Tower, and Flash ready to send Mata through, but LG... Making things a little bit slow. The guard, no control towards Dish. I mean, they really have nothing at all. There's no space for the guard whatsoever on any part of this map. The door pops open, oh, and that's ooh. the head of Tig popped. Maybe a slight overextension in this instance. Gives him this first kill in the ult. Oh, oh, very early in a peculiar position. Yeah. Yeah, that, that Viper Orb going up in, in quite the crafty position. That just forces out the rest of the players to go up from main, and there you go, Trent. A massive 2k on to LG as they try to sneak their way into the middle of B, and Trent, he can just continue to frag. We didn't see much of this over in the first game purely because everyone was able to frag out, but Trent, he's been one of the best players in the scene in the last month. Can he actually show it with a 4k, but no, he gets a 3k instead. Valen is there. It's gonna be so chaotic. The smoke dissipates immediately! There you go, Net. Able to find one, but he was just able to find some decent information. Dazzle, That's his dazzle spike was completely holes. spotted, but the rolling thunder, it's at least gonna hit onto Trent. It's the one target that they want. What other angles are the guard actually gonna have to cover off of this? So there goes the rolling thunder. Trent is still held up. The flash is massive! Oh, Trent is actually able to get a kill off that being discombobulated. Still a 3v3 though. And there goes the control oh. from Dish coming against them! LG! They don't watch their back line, and now the spike is dropped. Moose though coming in from the back, and it's the guard not watching their back line this time around. A very late lurk. The neural theft coming out now, 30 seconds left as both Moose and B-Dog have to retrieve the spike here, but it's out in the open. It's right where they can see it, B-Dog. Oh no, he... Yeah. Nobody's this is watching. Tough. Nobody's watching. They're gonna gift it right up here, and even then, B-Dog not able to find the frag, oh! goes for the repeat. And that's what you want, Saya though. Walking into the jaws of Moose, the timing, oh the timing is so critical. Oh my god! 10 oh, seconds no, 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 left! Nothing! Nothing at... Late push in, assuming that the guard will keep that angle, and... E-Dog able to hold his own now with the headhunter. 
And it looks like LG off of that to start their execution. Nothing really you can do here as again. We still have Moose on the other side of the map. Watching for that blank, but Saya, you could do at least net one. They do find a couple frags here in a four versus three. Yeah. Knocked down to three. I was about to say, Trent could actually make this round a whole lot more possible. Oh, Hello, oh, Nets. Whoa. To the back of the head of Tig. Where is Tig going? At least in the cold hands of Net. Now, here we go. Showstopper actually already up for Saya player. That is just... To put off a bit of danger, to scatter everyone in the middle of this site. Finally gonna use it. Back over in tower, but Mana pops out of the perfect time! And not only that, but has his own showstopper! Throws it right into the middle of sight, but only knocks down a little bit of HP from Net. They know where Dazzle is, they saw the flash a little bit earlier, but Mana coming up from behind. Gets the kill on the Jonah P. How much time does Mana actually have for this? Oh, Net! Net, he goes around sight, the nade comes! Sai player has a full kit of util, same thing here. From Trent, he has the fault line readied and primed. Oh, the cage will just allow them to creep up slowly. Fault line goes in. Oh, oh my goodness, Trent, even good for one, it's just enough. But Valen not able to hold down those lines. That'll push out the players in tower. And LG, good to take this control. I've kept the sight on lock as that brim smoke comes through. And not only that, but Tig is going to be the one with the plant wow. most likely. And he doesn't even need the plant. He gets the kill and he's able to get the extra ult point for that orbital strike. But again, hacking on a seventh here is the guard struggling for what feels like the first time we've seen really coming his way. Yeah, just a singular op here, though. Doesn't have any util to hold them back for a second longer, but he will be able to get away scot free. Now, a little bit of a slight peek. This is a triple Ooh. sniper setup and a double op setup. This is a tour de force coming into play here from net finally. These aggressive peaks, I guess the ops, the snipers are really what they needed. And again, Tour de Force will continue to push forward. A second cypher cage comes out from Moose. Net so quick on that scope. It's going to be good for another. Now suddenly LG and their anti-eco of all rounds are going to drop another yeah. here. As these ops, these the force, the Tour de Force really coming up big here. It's oh. just the one from Mata. He's not going to be able to find much as those rotations so quick. that they have the ops, now they're peeking, now they're fighting. And they're going to get bitten back for it. That Oh no. Now it's subtle control as well, oh, and it's even dish no. control moose. We'll get one, and they have the rolling thunder now in effect because of this tunnel play. But I don't even think they need to use it here. The peaks to try and get space back. It worked in the last one, but it doesn't work here. What was that? Oh, the timing! They toss the spike on over, still two players. Oh, Only no. one. No one gets affected. The flash coming up huge to keep them alive. And Valen, Again. a lovely trade, but it's just on the Sayak. Pinged out now by the cyber control net. A tight corner, does hear the jump, and Moose TP's out now, a little bit more info, Mata just sitting instead back over in tower, but it doesn't catch anyone, so now Trent's still watching over, the fall line is perfect, and the showstopper is even better right in the face of Jonah P, so there you go, the 1v1s that Jonah P were worried about, he just gets taken down in a flash right outside his own pit, we're still waiting for that orbital, but no, it's actually gonna be a fault line plus the orbital at the exact same time, great combo, and now it's a three on three. Spike was oh Spike wasn't even oh, down. Spike didn't go down. I thought for sure it would have gone left. down in the last second. It's not second. gonna go down. It's not gonna go down. Time is over. Oh, it's Trent. Oh my Trent. They're <laughs> not looking for too much control, but they will try and isolate this one fight on the dazzle. Oh, they did a really good job with it though. But dazzle still goes out and still gets the frags. Valen with two big ones actually opening things up still for LG, but you still have that space being taken back by. At least just Dazzle, but Dazzle finally goes down. Now only two players remaining for Luminosity. B Dog alongside Tig. Both coming in from mid. I mean, it's, it's the same instance here for L LG as well, right? Tig has only gotten the Molly. But he's exposed Saya play. Here, clear one angle. Is that really going to be enough? Because you have again a player up top. Oh, no, and they still Saya. lost it! Yeah, even then, Sai is able to run out that fight. So the guard, 4 for 4 on pistol. Last play again, we're going to see the similar nade aftershock combo, but instead, Sai uh, not going to risk missing. It's the judge up close, and that's a lovely, lovely combo from the guard to take that control. Fault line coming in. That'll stun a lot. Tig! Oh, Tig could be good for multiple, but Valen, good for at least that trade. We'll keep things to an even 3 versus 3. Oh, the wall. The boost up from Mata that was almost so good on top of that Viper wall to catch at least one kill on the Valen. But it doesn't happen, and now the guard, they have to crawl back. They had to take on at least one kill from that. They take down Moose, and now watch out for one more. Now. Dazzle, the 1v2, Ooh. and Dazzle misses out from behind! Oh, it could be easier than usual, but look at this. The guard, they're, they're 
they're pretty much compensating for this. They're not going for any sand for now. Only Here we go. Strike. It splits them up, though. It's literally only two players out on the site. They will get the spike down. Lovely nade from Sia player to catch B Dog off. Fortunate to find that frag now. A four on four. Trent tucked in with Sia oh. player. Huge rolling thunder Those coming through. And oh, showstopper is not exchanged, but instead Trent and Sia. The cross being the very first lead for the guard in this map. Luminosity have lost out on an eight front. It's only towards the B side. B Dog still gonna get an open opportunity at this first kill because of the gap and because of his boost, but he doesn't get any more. He drops down, and we're still getting a bit of pressure from L. And it's that camera. It does give a little bit of information, but it's only gonna buy just a couple seconds, and that's all LG needed. Okay, but these toxins are gonna go down quick. They're not fresh by any means. There goes Dazzle taking away the plant. Essentially, 50 seconds left. It's gonna be a free shot for Moose, but that Viper's pick comes up with a perfect time. Net lines up two kills, but now it's Jonah P in a 1v3. He's not even- wait, is he gonna be able to play in the middle of his pit? Gonna be able to play behind it at least, but he's gonna get pressured! The thrifty round back for L- Improving that fire rate just a little bit more and can make things a bit more- Ooh, a bit more chaotic! And out goes Mata with an immediate counter showstopper! That could have gotten so many if the guard had actually- Oh, if they had actually committed to this, but Tig going in, 50-50s it with net, swings out of the smoke and it works out perfectly. All three players still remaining for the guard, they've all been revealed. Shots clear on their sight, it will force Dazzle on this peak, but even then, Trent is good, but how good can he really get? So we know him to make nothing, Ooh. make something out of nothing, apologies, but that's 10 to 9. LG, dish is the only area not oh, really what a pop. tested. Big pop, like you said, three men out over towards Sand, and well, it's gonna be Dazzle to try and hold it back, but lovely trades through. B-Dog, alone in this sight, quick with the op, needs to find a little oh. bit more, but a jumping net will catch him off guard, and Mata, just trying to catch these players through the smoke. It will be a second attempt from Tig, but that's tied up. 50-50, but look at the rest. Look at the rest of the guard going in. Ned is actually able to take down Moose. That's a massive win. They take back Dish and the rest of the team. They already won the middle of sight. The guard now in a 5v4. That whole wrap through sand again. The Util pop and again, Trent. Oh, Trent? Just trying to take the fight to their face. He doesn't even need to do that. But he <laughs> no. still wants it nonetheless. They had the man advantage and they still maintain it. They remove Dazzle. That's all the flash has gone from this round. No one. Little strike. But there's nobody there. Nobody to receive. And now they're trying to approach slowly. Viper Orb up. They're still compensating for Dish. Valen has to get one here. Can he make it a second? Yes, he can. The guard. Try and hold them back. Again, early aggression from the guard. They're really switching up the tempo. One off for Valen to get on to his ultimate. And well, they're trying to take these fights. Door popped and one head gone. Dazzle. Ooh, Let's Dazzle go. is dry and it works out again. No one here for LG. It's going to be the 3v3 now to potentially close off this BO3. Two players already tucked in towards Sour. Two smokes to play with here for Tig. And all three of them are approaching from the same spot. At least they've got two right. Those nets stuck in the middle. He's oh, going to try and swing. What? Nets couldn't get it. He's stuck, denied, the teleport not connecting, and now Trent has the flash, but there's a player up close. There's a wrap even as well. Flash goes through, Jonah P to find one. It's not enough time, they only get it to half. Jonah P with a huge no, first frag, but they've it. already stuck it all the way through, and L. Now Saya, grabbing oh. that ult orb, is ready to pop on in, and it's going to be a fault line to clear out this site, but two players close and aggressive. Yeah, does not expect it. Nat going around the corner, going to be able to get one. Second, Mata with the SMG goes in big, and the TP, B Dog with a massive shot midair, and the TP goes away right before the short stopper connects. Here comes Jonah P, needs to get two here to really make this possible. He does. Indeed, he does it. Mata now with a showstopper, coast to coast, nailing Mata from the other side of sight, and the nade nails it too. Mata from the retake towards his A side, trademark, allowing them to play like this, and oh, that's a massive first pick Huge. from Trent. Four versus three now. Spike is still stuck towards that side. Dazzle has just Dazzle. They don't know. Ooh, Dazzle Trent. should have a free frag, but can he get a little more? Yes, he can. Oh, He's got two. He's got two. And he might have just saved the round there for LG. He One low HP has. comes up huge. Jonah P has to hold this cross there's nothing to keep him from it jonah p tagged down to 34 though oh and he's dead net now the last one remaining in a 1v3 come on dazzle that was the play to make everything happen here for lg no way he sneaks up from behind with 16 hp and he does it all now net 1v3 had an opportunity on the shot in the middle of sight but didn't connect playing his chamber
He has nothing to cover himself up with. He just has to fight this. Bit by bit, the Vandal's certainly gonna help. Both players still sitting up in tower. Waiting up for the opportunity. There goes a fault line, and there you go. LG taking HP and a double cross being held. Not good enough. It's a dink received to B-Dog, and he's not ready for oh. the next net, though. Quick to adjust. That does open things up here now for the offensive take. Mana, though, can line up multiple, but Saya player! What a flick! Back on to Mata. So three players remaining. Net coming in. Oh, but Net's gonna get absolutely slapped across the forehead by B Dog. What a shot. You can barely see the pixel of enough. Oh, oh no, no. Fault line being lined up for Dazzle, but instead Dazzle gets lined up alongside B Dog. This could actually be the tying score now for the guard, but in comes Moose and a 1v3, making a 1v2. The cage making it a whole lot tougher for any one of these players from the guard. Now, purely because nobody else is watching back down in tree, so he actually has to watch two angles. In goes Saya player, gonna be able to get one. There goes the flashback from Trent. Can, can Trent actually go in? No, no, I don't think so. The fault one's gonna be in a bit too late. Flash finally going in, and he's actually finally able to get the kill. Dazzle from behind. Trent, that 180 was almost nasty, but Dazzle Dazzle now realizing that the battle is still probably won just off of the damage. Now still has to bite out that 1v1. Net with a massive miss. Can't. Still three players in the middle of sight. Plant is still not going in. 20 seconds left. Saya player in a beautiful position. Can he get two? Yes, he can get two. 40 HP now remaining on Dazzle. And he is down and out for the count. How critical it is to have that tower control. The spike cannot go down freely. Trent just being a menace up top and nuisance. Over towards LG, the spike not able to freely go down to the guard, electing to take the time out here. The last time out they have is LG one round away from going 0-1 to kick off week one of the VCT in the guard. <laughs> it's been looking good. I mean, Trent at 25 kills. He's been massive so far with a 1v3 clutch, and even in that round, coming up huge again. I'll reiterate it to hold that tower position, LG. I mean, it's not your timeout, but you may as well make the most of it. You need Absolutely. to hold them off in this little camera from Moose, but he is exposed towards tower. The cage comes oh, up the one way. way through. Oh, but that peak, Saya. Good, good to find one. Now Moose has to hold it down. He pops the cage into tower as well. He needs to be the guardian, and he cannot let anything through. Oh, but he's not going to be able to find Net. Dazzle at the same time, though, with a big kill, and look how much ground they're gaining. Net has the crossfire. Jonah P with a big kill on the B-Dog. Dazzle still keeps it at a 2v2. Jonah P!